Spreadsheet is a portfolio manager, whose product teams, currently use spreadsheets, to plan their product launches. Let's help them, quickly create a roadmap, by importing their data, into Clarity PPM. Let's log into Clarity PPM, navigate to the Roadmaps page, and create, a new roadmap. Let's give it a name, and time period. Let's use the Import from CSV option, to download a CSV template, that can be used, to import roadmap items. These items, can be typically found in spreadsheets, or SharePoint lists. Let's review the first row of the template. It contains user-friendly names, and instructions for each field. You can see that the roadmap item name, is a mandatory field, and has a limit of 80 characters. The second row contains, API attribute ID, for each attribute. The default values are already set. For a smooth process, you should not delete or modify, these values. Let's start adding information. Did you notice, that we need to enter the date, in a specific format? Let's format the date columns, to ensure that date has the correct format. Because this is top-down planning, you are not required, to have all the data elements, to see the results. You may know the capital, and operating costs, for a brand new program, but not the ROI. If you have unique attributes, that you want to add, you can work with your administrator, to add them to the database. Now, let's save the CSV file, after adding all the roadmap items. Let's import roadmap items, from the CSV file, into Clarity PPM. Use the grid layout, to see the list of roadmap items, and the associated attributes. Let's add a few attributes to the grid, and ensure that they have been imported correctly. The product teams now feel confident, that they can quickly start managing product launches, by using roadmaps, in Clarity PPM. Thank you for watching this video. Watch the next video, in this playlist, to learn how you can create roadmap items, from projects, ideas, and custom investments, in Clarity PPM. For more detailed information, about Clarity PPM, click the information bubble, in the top right corner, to load the product page.